In My Shadow is a game with puzzles and platforms and lots of them. But what it has that others don't are shadows that the player can physically interact with and manipulate to help traverse obstacles and solve puzzles. Is any of it real or are you just inside a girl's dream? The game's developer talks a little bit more about how shadows work. Shadows are dependent on the caster and on the light. Using the objects, you can create a combination of a lot of shadows. And using those shadows, you can create a lot of shapes. Uh, and those shapes will be the core aspect of the level design. And you can create multiple shapes of shadows to solve the same level. So the freedom is entirely up to the player. One puzzle places an object shadow in front of you that's simply too large to jump over. The solution is to walk over, move the source of the shadow further away from the light, and watch the shadow shrink. And just like that, the game's core mechanics make sense. But In My Shadow takes that simple concept and keeps expanding upon it in surprising ways, weaving it together with an emotional story. This game has a very subtle narrative that I'm sure anybody can relate to. Just like the main gameplay mechanic. Everybody have actually tried to create shapes of shadows on their walls in their childhood. And that's the same feeling I want to instill in people when they come out of the game. In My Shadow will have you confront yourself in the past as it places many brain-bending obstacles in your way. Will you have what it takes to let go? Head over to Steam to try it out.